Hello, welcome back everybody. My name is Sab if you are new and today we are continuing our legacy challenge. Pretty early in the morning right now so I still have like a, a raspy, raspy little, raspy little voice. Really stoked to see that you guys enjoyed the last episode. Thank you again for all your sweet comments. Like it's always so nerve-wracking uploading a video after not uploading for a while. I don't know why, <laughs> it just is, but uh, I always like read your comments and then I'm like, okay, yeah. We're cool. They, they got my back. They get me. They understand. <laughs> but we're going to be continuing today. Hopefully Teddy will have her baby. I'm pretty sure that she will. Super stoked about this. I am sipping on an iced coffee today. My straw is way too big for this cup, but we're just going to ignore that. Thank you for being here. I love you. Let's just hop right into it, shall we? Let's go. All right, gang. Here we are back in the legacy household. It's honestly a little bit weird not having Zoe here. It feels very lonely. <laughs> I just, she was just such a comfort to have around. I don't really know how to explain it, but yeah, this was one of the most uh, painful air deaths because I feel like we have been with her for so freaking long just because like, ooh, Akira wants to buy our outfit. Oh, Akira, you legend. Don't mind if I do. Ship to buyer, $1,500,000. That is the most I've ever sold an outfit on Trendy 4. So this is, this is a big moment. Oh my God, she looks so good with all the flowers. Oh, I love this lot so much. It's just so aesthetically pleasing. That's a question that I have for y'all actually, because aesthetic is one of those words where people pronounce it like two different ways. They either say aesthetic or aesthetic. And is there like a proper way to say it? Cause I always say aesthetic, I always have. Let me know in the comments how you say it. I don't know if it's like a tomato tomato type of situation, but yeah, interesting. Anyways, so we have three days until they age up into adults. Um, Evangeline graduated early. She's doing like her little streamy thing to fill her time. Edison, I believe he uh, became an A student in the last episode which is good um he's feeling the effects from his mom's death it was so weird like she passed away and edison and ren didn't even notice and then they got like a phone call like a day later about it and then they started being sad so i don't really know like ren isn't even like sad about it anymore i think she's probably just used to all the death which sucks but i guess that's what uh it comes with the territory of being immortal you know <laughs> It's quite sad, but I mean, it is what it is. And freaking these, I don't know if Sir Isaac's corpse is making all of our plants like disgusting, but these orchids just do not want to get rid of their bugs. It's it's pissing me off. Why, why is the gardener here at 440? Are you good? Are you stuck? There is this like weeding glitch. Um, Yesterday in my stream, our butler was weeding one plant for like eight hours. And when she was done, like the weeds were still there. So I think it might be a weeding glitch. I don't know if, if it's gonna happen to Ren too. It kind of looks like it is. It's like every time a glitch happens, I'm like, there can't be a more annoying glitch than that. But then another glitch happens. And I'm just like, wow, that is actually really freaking annoying. <laughs> I hate it. Oh gosh, okay, we're working from home today. We're working from home today. What do we gotta do? Cross promote at venue? Oh my god, that's that's honestly so annoying. <laughs> like these tasks are, I should've just went to work, to be honest, I should've just went to work. <laughs> but did we get uh, entrepreneur level two from shipping out that outfit? We did, we did, we did. Okay, so that means that we can like, promote our stream online now, which will help us with our uh, our like work tasks, which is reach level four entrepreneur skill. Oh my God, look at how much money we have. Are we like not capable of making more than that? I've never had this issue before. I I'm honestly not sure. You making yourself some coffee? So all of these like party moodlets that Edison has been having, guiding light, oh. Um, I think it's pretty funny like when you guys commented like oh he was like so addicted to Teddy and like gaining her affection It makes sense that he would like easily get addicted to other things And I think that's kind of interesting to have him have like an addictive personality. We haven't really had a sim like that before so and I do have base mental drugs so like I have like 
that in my game. I've got cigarettes and like the alcohol is like real alcohol. It's not just the juice. So that could be, that could be an interesting storyline for Edison for sure. And then uh, so many of you guys commented that you want Ren to have another baby. Okay, you, you can stop weeding now, seriously. Um, and like you guys want her to have a baby with Caleb like really badly. Holy crap, we just sold these and they're already ready again. How is that possible? But I don't know if you guys remember, but Alice is Caleb's child. So they already had a child together. Um, but she wasn't a vampire, or she was a vampire, but she got turned human, so she ended up passing away. But yeah, she's already had a baby with Caleb, but we could totally have another one. I would love to see if they still have uh, chemistry. Oh my god! She had- that was so fast! When we went to go visit her in the last one, I felt like she was only in like her second trimester. <gasps> she had a girl, Sarah. I don't hate that name. I don't, it's just like very common, but. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We have to go visit like right now. Okay, you <laughs> you can't have more than $9,999,999. I don't even know if I'm saying that right, but you physically cannot have more <laughs> simoleons than that. That's kind of lame. I really wanted to see like how much we could accumulate over 10 generations. Let's go. Let's go see our child. I think I'm going to age them up into um, an infant right off the bat, just so we can have a look at her features. Cause when they're babies, you can't like tell anything. It's kind of annoying. I can't believe it. I think we're just going to have one baby this gen. There's really no need to have more unless it happens on accident. Ugh, okay, where's the child? All right, so. Why is the baby like that? How are we supposed to access it? Can we age her up from the back? Um. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, she's blonde. Just because freaking it, we dyed Edison's hair blonde, the game was like, oh, you're having a blonde baby. Well, I, hmm, I guess it could make sense because Zoe was blonde. Oh man. I don't know, you guys are gonna have to let me know what we should do about that, but let's head into Cass and have a look at her. She should be. She should be. Okay, Sarah. <laughs> Brown eyes and blonde hair, just like Zoe. It makes sense. I suppose it, it makes sense. Okay, Miss Honeypot, let's let's have a look at you. Let's put a skin detail on you and all that stuff. I don't know if it's just me, but a lot of my infants look really scary. But as soon as I put like a skin detail on, um, you know, maybe looking looking a little cuter. <laughs> <laughs> I really can't tell like who she looks like yet. I love this hair. I think it's adorable. Um, yeah, Sarah. Oh my God. She is an intense infant. I am so sorry, Teddy, that you have to deal with this. I really am. Oh man. Well, she is, she's really freaking cute guys. She's freaking adorable. I am so excited. I need to take some screenshots, of course. Our little bean here. The next heir, Sarah. Sarah Nicholas. No, it's gonna be Sarah Campos. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> I wonder when Teddy is gonna age up as well, and I wonder what it what her next trait's gonna be. Oh, I forgot she had these beautiful green eyes. I'm like debating updating her look a little. Uh yeah, I don't know. That's beautiful. I figured that's what her hair looks like when it's not in braids. I just figure, like, new mom, she probably wants something super low maintenance. Dang, she's gorgeous, though. Holy crap. Oh my god, should we buzz it? I kind of love this because her mom has, like, buzzed hair on the sides, too. So maybe she's just, like... I don't know, go, taking after her mom a little bit. She has such a pretty face, like I don't even think it matters what what hair we give her. We can give her some like cool piercings too because you can see her ears really well. Honestly, like if I had just had a baby, I would be like, I just don't want to worry about anything else. I just like, 
just super low maintenance, you know? She looks really, like, I freaking love it. I love it so much. I want to give her, like, a different everyday outfit, though. I feel like we've seen this outfit way too many times. Oh, my God. I love this. Oh, she looks so cute. The other two outfits, she's got this one, which I really like. This hmm. one. It's super alpha, but I like it. It looks good on her. All right, Teddy. I hope you enjoy your new hair. All right, where's she at? Where's our girl? Aw, how cute. I've never seen that before. I've never seen dogs do that. It kind of makes me sad splitting them up now. Where's the baby? Oh shoot, he's supposed to be at school right now. Gosh darn it, okay. All right, I'm gonna tell him to go to school. I'm gonna switch control back to the other house. Whoops. He should graduate early too, shoot. I actually think Teddy went to school as well. It looks like Tony and Freddy have their hands full taking care of the baby during the day. Oh, can we also like plan like stayovers? That came with the growing together pack. Yeah, we can invite them both over for stayovers. I totally forgot that was a thing now. Girly pop, why are you in here crying over the World Culture Network channel? All right, I'm having her do a stream. Uh, Ren is still out here weeding. Bro, I literally can't with you. I can't. All right, let's have you drink some plasma packs and then, um, I don't know, maybe we should go like hang out with Caleb and see if they still have, uh, you know. Let's see, what is our relationship like with him? Uh, it's still full, but we have no romance. Let's send him a text and see what happens. Why is Father Winter trying to join our vampire club? I, no, I'm sorry. You're not the right fit, my guy. You're really not. He never texted us back. Oof. All right, well, let's, let's do a little bit of a travel then and invite him along and see what happens. Whoa, I know what she needs. Oh, the banging on her knees to be popular. Hmm, let's go to the screaming gecko from the new pack with him. I can't remember if he uh, has the sunlight resistance trait. Oh, it's beautiful here. It looks like he does have sunlight resistance, which is good. Um, make vampire pun with him. Let's see how this goes. What? Did he just dip? Did he really just leave? He did! What the hell, Caleb? Come back! Well, we invited him and he's not here. I don't think he's interested in hanging out with us, guys. What are you doing? Seriously? <laughs> oh, man. What the? Where are we going? <laughs> well, that didn't turn out the way I wanted it to. What the hell? Does she have work or something? So I did find a substitute for uh, the plum tree app, like the family tree thing. Um, but the only thing is in order to share, oh yeah, she did, does have work. Okay. Well, hopefully she gets promoted today. Uh, the only thing is that in order to share a link to the tree, I have to pay monthly for it, which I don't know, like that kind of sucks. I really don't want to have to do that, but I might just have to bite the bullet. I tried looking at other like family tree create like like websites and stuff like that but nothing nothing hits the same like you can't like upload pictures and write bi bios and stuff like that nice edison's back all right let's go let's go back over to uh teddy's house and uh build our relationship with our daughter a little bit i would plan a stay over right now but it's the middle of the week I'm thinking on the weekend we can do that. Uh -uh. Oh god, your mood is so bad. We don't have any- wait, do we? No, we don't have any potions. She's so pretty. I love her new hair. It suits her. It definitely does. Yes? Who are you? Outstanding work. Ooh! Early graduation! I kind of want to. I kind of want to. No, no, we only have a couple more days being a teen and that will um, allow us to like actually go to graduation. Okay, where's the baby? Okay, seriously, what the heck? Where's the child? Mm. 
What's going on? Okay, I'm gonna have to switch to their household because I'm concerned. She's like not showing up anywhere. I think she might be stuck somewhere. This is totally against legacy rules, by the way. Uh, it says specifically you cannot control any family besides the legacy family, but I think I, I think this is a good reason to do it because she's literally missing. What the? Okay. Their house is over here, and she is all the way over here. Bro, how? That is concerning. <laughs> when do you age up, my girl? Ooh, what? Oh my god, she has so long until she ages up. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to age her up. Let's get their relationship up a little bit while we're here. He's in a really bad mood, and we don't have any potions. Dang it, he stinks. That is not a good screenshot. Boy, delish. Delish. I mean, she does look like his daughter, that's for sure. Oh, honey. He's handsome. He reminds me a lot of Charlie. Oh god, he's about to pass out. Okay, okay. All right, let's go home. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I pushed you too hard. Your moods are so bad. We need more potions. Sprinkles doesn't like us. Now I know which dog we're definitely not taking. I would buy a lottery ticket, but there's no point. We're maxed out on simoleons. Did y'all know that was a thing? That seems really dumb to me. Alrighty, let's take a shower and then go to sleep. Ren, did you get that promotion or what? You did not. Ugh! So frustrating. She needs to get level three in three careers. So I'm just really trying to get her to max this so we can move on to the next career. And she has so many aspiration points. What do we do with them? She doesn't have some, I swear she had this. Yeah, we need to get that for her. Absolutely. It only makes sense. Dude, really? You, you, <laughs> he passed out from being so tired and then immediately when he wakes up, he wants to kick a soccer ball. Oh my gosh, you can make steamed rice in the Instant Pot. I love that so much. Let's have a look at how our collections are going as well. We're supposed to be... <laughs> We're supposed to be working on these too. I can't believe we don't have all of the, like, plants yet. Dang, a lot of these are like from the uh, outdoor retreat pack or whatever. We still need trophies. We haven't done any of the collections yet. We're pretty close on a lot of them, but it sucks. We need like a pen pal for the postcards, right? Maybe Evangeline can do that. Um, Let's see, pen, find a pen pal. Dude, really? We weren't trying to use that or anything. Freaking computer hog. I posted on pen pal forums now to wait and see if anyone responds. Okay. Hopefully we get a pop up because I'm going to forget. I'm definitely going to forget. Who's that? Don't tell me that's freaking paparazzi. It is. Why are you glowing like that? Did you just get struck by lightning? I mean, I guess that's what you get for being on our lot. I swear, I thought she was gonna die for a second there. I really did. We need to find another skill for Ren to max. I was working on robotics, but it's been raining so much and our robotics thingy is on the roof. Let's see what we got. Oh, we could totally do nectar making. That could be cool. Programming, I think she already did that one. Snowboarding could be cool. Did she already max writing? I need to look and see what she's already done. Pet training, mixology, DJ mixing, dancing, singing, vampire lore, pipe organ, parenting, photography, media production, acting, beer brewing, knitting, medium, cross stitch, wellness, baking fit. Jeez, dude. Oh, she hasn't done research and debate. Is that something that we can do on the computer? Or do you have to have a podium for that? What is it? Research genealogy? What is that for? What skill is this helping? Dang, she's almost max robotics. Too. It doesn't look like that helps any skill. 
Weird. Research and debate. How the hell do I need to get a podium for that? I don't really want to put a podium in this house, but I guess we could put it in her house. It's like one of the only skills we haven't done yet. Ah, the electromagnetic research archive machine. That's what we need. Wow, this machine is so incredibly uggles. It's terrible. <laughs> Okay, that's just gonna be there temporarily while she works on this skill. All right, there we go, she did it. Let's just keep researching things. I guess that is how you do it. And then we need to also start a gathering to get that skill boost. Yeah, she should max it very, very soon. Good morning. Okay, how many days? Two more days until you age up and until graduation. We got this. See, look, she's already level three. It's been like two seconds. All right, Edison, I'm gonna need you to come up here and clone these. We need more. All right, Ren, how's your skill coming along? Oh my God, level seven already. Absolutely insane. Oh, she hasn't maxed bowling. Okay, okay. Evangeline, you're seriously not swimming right now. You are, you're swimming in the pond. Wow. Um, anyways, so <laughs> let's get you to go to the bathroom and take a shower and then you need to keep working on your comedy skill, my girl. Oh my god! Caleb wants to hang out now! He wants to go to a nightclub. Okay, let's do it. Whoa, I didn't expect that to happen. I thought he was done with us for sure. Okay, we are at a nightclub in Chestnut Ridge. Alright, um... Let's just, let's just, let's test the vibes. Who died? Console about death? Was it Zoe? Oh, Lila's here too. <gasps> Are you single? He is. Wow, he stayed single this whole time too. I really want to know who died. Also, Ren, can you get out of your freaking work outfit? <laughs> She's always wearing this. He is just not into it. Look at him. He's just like a lifeless, a lifeless body. Cheer up, parent. What? Hold on one second. I need to see if he's had more kids. He has. Death by electrocution, when did that happen? Okay, so he has a son, Jacoby Fleming, Greg, and then Alice. I wonder when Greg died. But who, did, who did he have a kid with? Oh, it doesn't say. Huh, Fleming though, someone with the last name Fleming. Yeah, his family tree is, is massive, holy crap. <laughs> Dude, girl, chill. Oh my god, we have work again. Dude, work always be getting in the way. Oh my god, we have negative romance with him. But why? I guess we've, we've laid it on too thick when he just wasn't in the mood. All right, Ren, you gotta go. You need that last promotion, and I have a feeling you're gonna get it today. I think we're gonna go to the movies tonight. I really wanna see, um... Oh, the boy and the heron. I want to see it so badly. I've heard great things and I've also heard terrible things. Oh, if you've seen it, let me know what you think. I'll, uh, I'll report back in the next video about what I think after I see it tonight. It has a really good cast of voices, voice acting. All right, Evangeline is finally happy. So how do we check the status of our pen pal? Check for pen pal replies. Not the Windows XP background. Uh, what? Why do you want to invite Mari over? No, that's weird. My new pen pal is in Twinbrook. I've always been curious about their swamps. What else can we do now that we have one? Write letter to Twinbrook. Oh my god, are you serious? Addicted to caffeine. What are you not addicted to, bro? I hate it when it's storming out. It's so hard to do anything. Craving a cup. Holy crap, my dude. Fine. Get a cup of coffee. <laughs> First it was alcohol, now it's coffee. Also, how's your charisma coming along? Level eight. Nas nasi lemak. Rice, nasi coconut easy. milk. Oh my god. This game will never cease to uh, 
like get me to crave something. I want Thai food now so bad. Might have to hit the Thai food place before, before the movies. <laughs> oh man, I'm so happy to like be around things now and just like have the like option to do things. Cause literally at my old house, the movie theater was like an hour away. A freaking movie theater, an hour. Like it just like makes you not want to do anything. Oh, she did it. She freaking did it. Concert Virtuoso. Rock Legend Sign Guitar. Oh, that's a dope reward. Okay, well, Ren, since you maxed that one, let's go ahead and quit and find another one. Alright, find a job. What should we do next? He's been really into tech and research and debate lately. Research and debate. Should we do lawyer? That could be kind of cool. Yeah, let's do let's do lawyer. Okay, we did it. We did it for our aspiration. Um, we let's see. We started the job at level four. That's pretty sick. Pass the lawyer's exam to become a certified barrister. A sim must first pass the lawyer's exam. This can be com completed as an interaction on any computer. Hmm. I've never done the lawyer career before. Yeah, research and debate was the skill that we needed for this job. Oh, she actually left to take the exam. Okay, cool. Boy, you need to keep practicing your speech. Wait, what? Bellamy marries someone named Addison Palma? What the hell happened to... M what? What happened to... to uh, Frick, what was her name again? No! You literally have so many kids with her, what happened? Okay, Ophelia got married to Reginald Pleasant. Marnie got married to Sean Harris. Sorry, Why did we just become good friends with Vlad? And Annabeth and Alonzo, I'm so confused right now. Why are my sims like this? Why can't they just like stay with their partners? Manami. Okay, their birthdays are tomorrow. What do we do? Did we pass the exam? We did! Hell yeah. Do we not get a pop-up about that? Oh, wow, we actually completed this aspiration as well, the Renaissance Sim one. <gasps> Let's go! What's the next one? Oh, it's Neighborhood Confidant. Successfully advise and influence the lives of other Sims. Become good friends with five Sims. Achieve level seven charisma. Easy. So I'm gonna get Edison to go to his last day of school today. And then we'll invite Teddy and Sarah for a sleepover. And then, um, yeah, we'll have their birthday parties as well. Find out their last trait. Um, probably move Evangeline out, honestly. I really want her to max her comedy skill before we do that, though. And she is only at level 7 at the moment. Oh, wait, it's July 4th. There's no school today, right? Okay, yeah, okay, so he doesn't have school anymore. Nice. So it's wow. July 4th, it's the day before their birthday, so I'm thinking that we should just like celebrate everything today. We're gonna go have a barbecue at the park or something. I wonder, I wonder if there's like a July 4th lot that we can place. Let's go lots, let's go most popular. Um, let's see, lot type, maybe like a park, July 4th park, there's one, it has great reviews, everyone loves it, alright, let's go place it somewhere, July 4th at the park, I'm gonna place it in Chestnut Ridge since the weather is always really nice there, let's put it at this red round field, they'll just make each other their cakes, that's kind of cute, aww, she made the cake and she put it in the fridge after? What the? My sims never do that. Alrighty, I'm gonna need you to put some candles on this bad boy. Okay, uh, it's raining here again. I might have to change the weather. Oh, the weather is absolutely beautiful. Fantastic, perfect. All right, everyone seems to be in a great mood too. Okay, please tell me that there's like a table that I can put the cakes. Wow, look at, look. This lot is gnarly. <laughs> There's a lot going on. Oh, what a nice pool. Got a barbecue area. 
Okay, let's put the cakes out over here. Why is there a magical portal here? <laughs> it's random. I don't know what's going on, but I can't place the cakes straight from their inventory. That is so annoying. All right, I'm gonna get each of them to grill something so that they uh, get the little thingy because we got a barbecue, fireworks, fire, and water fun. Oh, look at the little, Oh, how cute. They put little party spinners here. You can't use them, but still, that's adorable. The water balloon fights in this game are so like, <laughs> they're so boring. They're so anticlimactic, but whatever. It counts as a water sport. Are there any fireworks around as well? Cause like, that's a huge part of July 4th. It doesn't look like it. We might have some sparklers in our inventory left over from some weddings that we could use. We do! Holy crap. Let's go. I freaking knew it. <laughs> light the sparkler, my guy. Light it, light it, light it. I need, I need to do all the quests. Wait, what was that? Lifestyle games? Single and loving it lifestyle. <laughs> Never freaking fails. Oh my God, it's already nine o'clock. Holy crap. All right, we should probably do the cake real quick. All right, bud. Happy birthday. I'm so excited to see what your freaking last trade's gonna be. Ooh, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Happy birthday! Woo! Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, shoot. I totally forgot the way that we do the legacy traits is we have to enter in the traits of his parents. And I'm not gonna lie, I totally forgot what they are and I can't look at my plum tree app. Well, I did export it. Oh, 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 I can still see it. Okay, I found the down, I found the download. So let me see. Oh, he, oh, perfect, I did put them in. Okay, Lamar is family oriented, geek and ambitious and Zoe, clumsy, creative and geek. All right. Here we freaking go, guys. Here we go. Third trait and aspiration, I believe. Let's see what we got. Genius. And the fabulously wealthy aspiration. Interesting. Okay, okay. I like it. I like it a lot. I love the genius trait. That's pretty easy, though. He's pretty much got that aspiration in the bag already. And he's valedictorian. That's what I'm talking about. That means we will start all careers a couple levels ahead. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, Evangeline, it's your turn. Come over here. Make a wish. Blow it out, blow it out. Make a wish. Come on, girly. I love how no one is celebrating. That's, that's pretty dope. Happy birthday, honey. Imagine they get the same third trait. Because they have the same two other traits. That would be crazy. That's true, 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 true twin things right there. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Is that supposed to be the Declaration of Independence? Um. Anyways, okay, let's see. So we're just going to do generate another child. Vegetarian and expert nectar maker? What? Okay, sure. I love the vegetarian trait, but nectar maker, that, that's that's interesting. Okay. As far as the job Hello. goes for Edison, I think that we agreed on like civil designer, right? Yeah, we did. Cause, okay, so logic and charisma are the skills that we need for this. I think that makes sense. Because if he's a genius, logic, that pretty much goes hand in hand with that. All right, well, let's go ahead and get him his job then. Next so Evangeline's job. gonna be a comedian who's really into making wine. That's kind of cool. I like it. All right, civil designer. It's not my favorite career, but I think it makes sense for the story. What level did you start at? Level three, not bad, not bad. Okay. Um, yeah, so it's the entertainer career, and then we eventually choose the comedian branch for that. What level did Evangeline start at? Three! Cool! Alright! So that's done. Done and done. How old is Sarah right now? 
Still an infant. Okay. All right, guys. Well, I think I'm going to leave this one right here. In the next one, we will move in Teddy and the baby, I think. She's probably almost a toddler. And then we're gonna move Evangeline out, quote unquote out. We're gonna make um, Edison a landlord for this lot. And then um, we'll have this be her house that she will live in. Like we'll set this as her residence. So she will be living on the lot, but we won't be controlling her. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Yeah, and then we'll we'll just keep on keeping on with this gen, guys. I'm pretty satisfied with the traits that they got. The aspirations are fine. Yeah, I'm really excited to see like how things are gonna turn out once Teddy and the baby move in. I wonder if it's gonna go well or not. And he has to practice his like graduation speech. So we'll be going to graduation and he will give the speech and all that. Probably in the next one too. I don't know when graduation is. Oh, yeah, it is on Sunday. Okay, so it's literally tomorrow. So yeah, we'll be doing that in the next Whip episode too. I think graduation's Don't really cute. You get to pick your own cap and gown and all that. Um, I love how it's not a rabbit hole. Pretty fantastic. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Let me know what you think of Sarah. Let me know if we should keep her blonde or not. Let me know if we should keep her name or not. Um, I think it would be kind of weird to change her name though. Like we might offend Teddy in some way. <laughs> but I love y'all so much. I hope you're having a fantastic Sunday. And if you're interested in watching some of my live streams, I'll be live tomorrow and then every other day after that. So I love you. Thank you for being here and I will see you in the next one.